pass through the lands of the Rus. I cannot shake the feeling that he's taunting me, waiting until I'm a day's ride away before moving on. I will not be home before the winter, as I hoped. I've stopped at a small village by a glassy lake they called Svetloyar. The prophet spoke here, and now the villagers refuse me lodging. I slept on the banks of the lake, where a young man bearing a crude version prophet's icon tried to kill me as I dozed. I made an example of him, and now the people fix me with the evil eye, spit at me as I pass. I must move on soon. His sickness spreads. An arrowhead carved from bone. This looks like Mongol craftsmanship. This was a whistling arrow. Mongol archers would fire these over their enemies to frighten and confuse them. A sort of passport. Whoever held this spoke with the authority of the Mongol Empire. It reads, By the power of eternal heaven and order of the Empire, whoever does not show respect will be guilty of an offense.
Byzantine war galley. How the hell did it get down here? Mongolian. They passed through here. I must be close to the lost city. Team brooch. The enamel work is beautiful. This portrait has been defaced. It looks like it was depicting the prophet. They must have had to hide their faith. <laughs> 